Larry, there was so much food, it was hard to resist. But even better than that, it was a day for these men to reflect and spend Christmas with who they consider family. Rick Stanford has lived the past five months at another chance house as a temporary guest, there to meet a forever life goal. Had a career, lost a career, uh, and uh, found myself in the, the depths of, of alcoholism and drug addiction. Stanford says he needed a fresh start before things got worse and decided the program was just what he needed. I've, I've uh, made a personal commitment to be here for a year and, and uh, I have uh, I've, uh, committed to that. And what I hope to do is is uh, become self-sufficient and, and uh, get a, a program of recovery under my belt. With 18 houses and 69 men, another chance house takes formerly homeless men and gives them just that, another chance. They have to do their part in, in whatever, whatever the reason is that they became homeless, whether it be drug addiction, alcoholism, mental illnesses, loss of family, loss of job. You do your footwork and, and we'll, we'll give you a, a safe and, and clean place to stay. According to Nixon, men who are admitted to the program stay anywhere from 12 to 18 months and each day with a new goal. But on Christmas, with goals set aside, it was time to celebrate as a family. Well, you see it. Just uh, come have lunch together and, uh, you know, just be around other people that are in the same shoe, identify with each other and just support each other all in the panhandle spirit. We have to realize that, that life does go on no matter what mistakes we've made in our past. This is a place where you can clean up those mistakes and, and that people really do care about you. Stanford tells me he got to spend some of the holidays with his real family, but that another chance house is where he needs to be until he feels he's ready to be back home. Larry, back to you.